Ahoy there, YouTube! I'm back again today for another Kickstarter critique where I take a look at a different Kickstarter tabletop game project every weekday at 1.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Get my honest thoughts on how the project is being ran, and today I'm a liar. It's not a tabletop game, it's a lawn top game, and I'm just a sucker for games of this ilk. I'm very excited to be checking out the sixth most popular project on all the Kickstarter games right now. That is Bocce Roll, and they want to let you know that's trademark. Meet your new favorite yard game. Bocce Roll has reinvented a classic yard game adding more obstacles for endless fun. That sounds right up my alley. I see that I'm going to be, you know, getting balls and throwing them up a ramp and trying to get it into these little holes, ski ball style, and that looks like a lot of fun to me. Uh, I'll be quite frank. Uh, I feel like the main image does a perfectly good job of getting me hyped about this product. I know exactly what I could expect to get in this. I'm imagining this is going to roll up and the balls will go inside of there or something like that. Uh, has reinvented a classic yard game, adding more obstacles and endless fun. But I guess about the only thing I'd like to know is how many people can play it, I guess, but I imagine it's going to be a pretty high number. As always, we're going to go in the video. I'm thinking three things. Do I want it? Can you do it? How much is it? Let's go. Like many people, we're always looking for ways to spend more Ooh, time nice. outside, and yard games are the perfect way to get fresh air and have fun with friends. That's why we created Bocce Roll, a brand new yard game that's a blast to play, is super portable, and is really, really, really ridiculously good looking. Yep, all fits in there, nice. Bocce Roll is a combination of bocce and ski ball, and is cleverly designed to play anywhere outdoors with a group of two mm. to four friends. Although the rules are simple, winning the game poses a fun and addictive challenge that will keep you entertained for hours. Just roll it, launch it, and nail it. Did you ever wish you could bring your favorite yard game anywhere? Well, now you can. Bocce Roll is easy to carry and conveniently fits any of your travel needs to the park and beyond. It's also easy to set up and take down, and its patent-pending design allows the ramp to easily roll up. That was a nice little stop-motion uh, camera thing right there. That was really good. And serve as storage for the entire... So six balls, five things to hold it, ramp, simple. I mean, you could probably figure out how to play right now already. I love it. Game. Any way you roll, transportation is a breeze. Bocce Roll is made of premium materials that were tested to survive years of barbecues, beach picnics, and backyard happy hours. With its hardwood bocce roll balls, impact resistant polymer targets, and bamboo ramp, bocce roll not only looks great being played at the park, but also looks at home, in your home. Over the past two years, we've poured our hearts into bringing bocce roll to life. Our team of engineers, designers, and manufacturing experts have built and tested countless prototypes before landing on the final design. We even went through an initial round of field testing with pre-production units, and the feedback has been incredible. Now, we're eager to release Bocce Roll to the world and bring new ways of fun to outdoor get-togethers, but we need your help to kick off our first production run. Pre-order this fun, portable, and great-looking game now. Help us get Bocce Roll off the ground and into your hands. Want this for camping trips for sure, Sean said. Agreed 100%. It looks fun. Like It just, it just looks like a super fun game. And it's going to happen. 930 backers have made this possible. Let's get that price. Um, so after the video, do I want it? Yes. Can you do it? Uh, I feel like you did a pretty serviceable job in that video. You walked me through how you've been prototyping this, and you showed me some of the old prototypes. So that's all nice. And can you do it? Yeah, I'll give it a tentative yes. Then how much is it? I don't know. I'm going to guess around 100 bucks, 90 bucks, somewhere around there. We are a team of engineers, designers, and manufacturing experts who know the quality fun is a beautiful thing. We believe in healthy competition, irresistible fun, quality materials, and thoughtful design. So we got a website. I always, I'm always so curious about these websites. I just, I feel like whenever I see one of these, it's, I don't know. It just seems so dated to me. Like if it doesn't have anything aside from pretty much, hey, we'll let you know when the Kickstarter's up. Uh, Bocce roll blends the best part of ski ball. Got it. Stash it. Bring it. Play it. Bocce roll highlights. Ooh, we have the measurements. I'd love if you told me inches as well, especially since you know you're from Wisconsin. You say so. It's like why? Why would you give me centimeters if you're from Wisconsin? Well played. Uh, Ten pounds. Why didn't you give me kilograms there? Like this is so weird to me. That we're just like we're just all willy dilly with these three minutes to set up designed for grass works great on sand insanely fun to play everyone loves it small enough to carry on check the states okay check the stats states stats stakes i can't read it it's very tiny text quality fun is a beautiful thing take bocce roll everywhere you got the the stakes go in roll it launch it nail it 
Yeah, looks good. How to play? I just want a price. Can we stop beating around the bush here? Just hit me at that price. I see. I see how to assemble. It seems really simple. This makes me want to, I, you know, I've always thought that a dry Euro game, but if it was a yard game, would be such a cool combination. So one points, three points, three points. Oh, oh, what is this? You get uh, to score. There are two ways to score points. Players get the number of points marked on each target for every ball that goes into the target. Similar to bocce, the player that is closest to the Polina gets the number of points equal to how many of their bocces are closer to the Polina than the other team's nearest bocce. Oh, is there a Polina? I don't know what that means. I've never really played bocce ball. Double up on the Polina, the measuring tape. Uh, it's not just for setting up the cones. Use it during the game to see who is closest to the Polina. Cool. Make it harder. Require the winner to hit exactly 21, a la, what is it, uh, Cornhole. Great. Materials and designs. Here's the stuff. Things inside. Uh, Claude Dreffel, Ben Fisher, Nikki Hagman. So we got people. They've done stuff. Very tiny text. Uh, our manufacturing partner. We feel lucky to have found the perfect design and manufacturing partner to bring Bocce Rule to life. Line Modern is a comprehensive team of designers, engineers, product development, blah, blah, blah. Uh, project timeline. It seems as a winning idea as Make 48 PBS, the Roku channel. Okay, cool. August 2021, 20, Make 48 competition concept and evaluated. So I'd love if, if I'd love to see some pictures from this of people just prototyping and trying it out. I mean, you had some in the video. It'd be great here too. We need your help. Facebook, Instagram, shipping. We're currently only shipping to the United States. There will be a set rate of $15 per bocce roll game set. We're not planning to stock and warehouse multi-packs, so games will ship individually for those reward packages. That's fine. Uh, so in and out the door, 15 bucks shipping. Only the United States of America because they don't want to overextend. I get that. You, you start adding... Ooh, what is that? Go further. What is that? That's a table? I want to check that out. Is that is that tabletop? That's a table. I'm covering that. That looks hot. Look at that table. Okay, focus, focus. Uh, so, price. One bocce roll, $79. That's pretty dang reasonable. $94 in and out the door for something that, in theory, you're going to have for the rest of your life and be able to bring out for decades to come. And, and it'll be something that you get out at barbecues and camping trips and at the beach, and you'll kind of be known for something like this. I have a game called Kingdom's Lawn Game. There's people who know me specifically. Like, oh, did you bring that one ball game? It's great. Great game, by the way. Uh, launch special. Save 36 off. So what's the what's the spe what's special about this? Oh, this is the VIP special. Oh, okay. So there's the VIP special. There's the launch special. There's the early bird. There's the two bocce roll early bird. We have the four bocce roll early bird. Come on, really? And then we have so there's not there's not just like a regular pledge level. We only have, everyone is fancy and exclusive and VIPs and early birds. Well, when everyone's special, no one's special. Okay, it just feels like you have a seventy nine dollar price point. Maybe that's what they're trying to do, trying to shove you into that. Um, but cool. So. Uh, two bocce roll VIP specials of so 48 backers. Is, was this early birds or something? Were these like a specific limited time? There's a lot of pledges here. It's weird. Six backers. Who is that backer? Okay. I, I, I'm getting too much of the minutia here. Uh, so it looks good. 94 bucks in and out the door. Seems reasonable, I guess, for a wood style lawn game, especially with how expensive wood is. FAQ, no FAQ, no updates at all. We just launched yesterday, though. Uh, let's check out the comments. Not much excitement or engagement here. Super stoked about this. I've been patiently waiting for it to go live and can't wait to follow the progress. Do the targets often get knocked down for the flying balls? That seems like something that would happen. I believe they have stakes to secure the targets. Yeah, that wasn't really clearly, I felt like, uh, emphasized in the video what exactly the stakes do. I thought it was actually for the for the rolling thing itself, the thing you're going to roll out. Without the security of the cards, they would be easy to knock over. This looks fun. The targets appear to have metal stakes. Cool. This project looks great. I'm glad that I can get in early. See, I see two different ball designs in the photo, full color and natural with a stripe. Are they both going to be available? I really like the natural. Thanks, Alan. We're planning on adding FAQs here soon, so thanks for the question. We'll be going with the natural with a stripe. The balls are made of a premium beech wood. I'm going to guess it was a prototype components. Nice, looks good. I'd really like to see an add-on for stakeless play. There's not much grass or sand where I live, but turf is somewhere we... Okay. So. Looks good. I will say, I will say, something about this seems a smidge bit off to me. Like, I don't know what it is. I can't quite pinpoint it. I, ju I don't know what it is. But I, I, I'm, I'm trying to be positive here. I'm trying to be a super positive person. Uh, but it looks fun. And that's it. We're in and out. Ten minutes. So do I want it? Yeah, I do. It looks fun. 
How much is it? Seems reasonably priced. $94. It's got wood. It's got big wooden balls. It's chunky. It's what I like to call an heirloom game, which is like a game that, you know, if you die, someone in your family is probably going to want this game. You know what I mean? Like, it's never going to probably leave your family, assuming it is as good as they say it is. Uh, Sean says, B, no price selection, a mess of packing, a backing price with all the early bird VIP and such. So not needed. I agree. I think, like, one clean, clear price would have been nice. Maybe a couple couple buy two of them i guess but yeah and then can you do it i'm gonna go with yes i feel like you showed me a lot in that video you showed me the prototypes looks good i would not be surprised at all if this was not actually a company from wisconsin i mean i just i get that vibe i get a little bit of that chinese factory vibe just a smidge bit you know which hey it's not the end of the world i don't i don't care if you're chinese factory but at the end of the day yeah i still think i'm gonna be too didn't waste our time either. 11 minutes. Holy guacamole. Bocce roll. Meet your new favorite yard game. One of the shortest Kickstarter critiques I've done in quite some time. And and, and it's under 100 bucks. You know how often you get out of a Kickstarter without spending 100 bucks? Yeah. So I'm going to give it a B. But I am going to look at one thing here. I want to look at one thing real quick. Because it just, it just, that, what, what, I want to check out their rewards. And I want to check out the four bocce roll early bird. And then where, didn't it show the backers? Oh, it doesn't. Okay, so I'm just going to go with a B. B with a spidey sense tingling. Just a little bit. And I don't know why. It's like one of those ones where people are like, I don't know what's wrong. Something's weird. Something's off. Can't put my finger on it. I think it's just at centimeters. Like, if you're from Wisconsin, why are you telling me centimeters? Like, and I don't care if you're from outside the United States of America. I wa- You know what? I wonder if they're teaming up with someone from inside the United States of America and they're from actually outside the United States of America, which once again, it's not shady or unethical. Companies do it all the time. It's just weird when, I don't know. Yeah, we're going to go with a B. I'm going to go with a B minus because that's Spidey Sense. But at the end of the day, it still looks really cool. It looks like a fun game. And I'm out of here. Bocce Roll, meet your new favorite yard game. It looks like it might be a cup of tea. Be sure to check out that Kickstarter link down below. Also, if you enjoyed the content, please be sure to click on the subscribe button down below as I'm trying to reach 17,000 subscribers in 2023 to make it my biggest year ever. Bye-bye.